Oh, hey guys, going through all the, our clothes and stuff like that. Um, I only got one shirt. Seriously, guys, that's the one line there. It needs to be washed. That's the only shirt I can fit. Um, my chest and shoulders has gone too big for everything I fit, which is a bit annoying. Um, but also, it gives me a chance of trying to consider getting some new clothes, um, even though I can't afford it at the moment. <laughs> but um, definitely sort out my clothes. There's so much stuff I can't wear anymore and that I won't wear anymore. Um, I mean, I, I have t-shirts and that's that there. T-shirt I had for more than almost about 10 years. So it's about time to say goodbye for those. And then we're going to the old house to uh, finish cleaning and then lock the door for finals last time. Aren't we? Yes. Yes. Um, Paul took a moving box out, which we were going to pack One stuff. One of these before it was chewed. Yeah, a box like that. This is before. And then and that's he, after. Sally just had this silly game of ruining... What's that? What's this? Cardboard. Yay, cardboard. But she took it upon herself to take that box, which we were actually going to use. We we're going to put it in the trailer. She took the box herself and started chewing it up. So, thankfully we got more boxes over in the workshop here. I didn't show this last night. Um, Paul had a table where there was like this little extractable table underneath. Fits perfectly in there. And it's not screwed or anything in there guys. It's just, it just sits there. Um, I'm just trying to make a bit of room. And it just stands there on the, on the weight. It's hanging on um, itself. So that's kind of cool. Um, oh well, I think it is definitely. So it's going to be a nice guest room when we're done. Hopefully, I will come back and do a little bit more in here. Um, saying it's a guest room, it's also going to be storage for the clothes we don't wear. Like winter clothes goes in here in the summer, summer clothes goes in the winter. So that's what we're going to be using that for. Yeah, we got some boxes here we can bring along. Um, also, a whole lot of stuff we need to go through. There's a lot of stuff to go up there. Talking about we wanted to use the upstairs also as a guest area where we could sleep because there was like so much space. Can't do it. We have too much storage uh, stuff up there. Um, that's fine. I mean, we can easily sleep two people up in my office and sleep two people in there easily and we got room for one on the sofa. So in total we can sleep five people here uh, and seven with ourselves. So. Alright, we're actually almost really, really getting done. Um, those of you, I'm going to be doing recording a Danish video doing all this, but I'm going to give you a room tour now how the old house looked like because a lot of you people have requested that and you never saw that, but now it's empty so it's easy. First you walk in, that hallway, in here, everything is cleaned. We walk down here, two doors, one down to the basement where I have my workshop, then here, toilet downstairs, and there's building covers there and there, plenty of space on that. Kitchen out here, nothing fantastic about that. Um, just reminding me I need to bring these tools here uh, before I go home. So yeah, and there's a door in here, leads into what was the dining room. Um, quite big room, actually it's big. This is dining room the same size as our actual living room is now. So um, that's quite a downsize because we have all this as well. That was where we had our living room. So you can see that was a quite big house we lived in here now. Uh, plenty of space. No in the living room here. And we had out there to the garden. Then in here, that was also part of the living room, put that wall up. Because that was one big living room here. And uh, here Paul had his office. So that door doesn't go anywhere. It's been blinded off. But why they haven't moved, I don't know. So yeah, that's the downstairs. I'll go and show the upstairs. Up this flight of stairs here. We got all our blinds hanging here. We need to bring those tomorrow. So uh, yeah, let's start this way here. On the right, this out here was our bathroom, our only bathroom. Kind of small, but it was fine. We we we, we covered our needs. Door here to a very small office. Uh, we use that as a storage room. 
very tiny. Out here again. And we go out here. You probably remember this room. This was my office. This is where I used to chill and relax. Uh, it's a big office. I would say it's the same size as what I got now. Uh, it just feels differently because here it's a lot higher and no leaning walls as I got now. But I like my new one as well. This one was better. <laughs> and over here there's a little place where we normally had our laundry bin. Here was our main guest room, oh, sorry, bedroom. This is where we normally slept. It's a quite large room. Um, actually, it's a very large room. So, um, yeah, that chair I put for sale. Someone's going to come pick it up later. And then in here, there's a final room, which we use for guest room, which is also quite a large room. So you can see it's, it's a very big house this year. Uh, maybe not for American standards, but for Danish standard, it's a big house. So, yeah. This is where we used to live. Not anymore. Um, as you know, we've got a new house now. We're smaller. I would say we've gone down about half size, which is great. Um, the only problem, the only problem we met with having to go down half size is, God, we have a lot of stuff which we had no problems fitting here. So, it finally looked like we succeeded. We took the last trailer full of stuff over today, so the old house is empty, which is like, Oh my god, you can't believe how nice it is. It's been a really, really tough move. Um, but we've done it, and we're really, really happy with that. Um, so from now on, we can concentrate about getting this place set up to be nice and clean and all that. Um, well, clean. It is clean, but I just went um, sorting out. All that stuff is just all over the place right now because we've just been going over, empty the trailer, loaded more trailer st stuff in the trailer, come over here with it. So, yeah, really, really, really great to get it done. Oh... Uh, Oh my gosh, the light. Oh, you can see above there. That's how it looks above. Yeah, and down. Hello, Shelly. I also found out I have an awesome fingerboard, fingerboard spot, spot here. Right here, if I'll put the camera like that. Um, it's here, it's like a great, great place. But I think it still hurt. I can't believe why my finger still hurt when I fingerboard. Um, it's like in here, I think I sprained something in there. It's still painful. How about treble loop? No. There we go. Kick flip. Uh, heel flip. Um, rail kick. Oh, touch of it. Rail kick. <laughs> but yeah, it is really, really great. Um, being done with most of the old place. Um, I'm gonna miss some things in the old place. I'm gonna miss having so much space. Um, but we got plenty of space here for us. I mean, we're only two people and one Sally, which is down there. <laughs> um, yeah, but right now I feel a bit hungry. I wanna treat myself to some ice cream. We got some ice cream down in the freezer, so I'm gonna go down and have a little slice of that. Um, I think we have some chocolate sauce as well, not too sure. I need to get some better light in here. Uh, this bed here. Oh, if I come on that, you'll see who comes up here as well. <laughs> yes, hello, Sally. She's been sleeping on this air bed here. Yes. That's so why we need to wash all the bed linen. So it's clean when we get guests, isn't it? <laughs> You're giving kisses. You're giving kisses. You are so sweet. She's a lovely dog. She's my girl. You're my pretty girl. Yes, you are. She had Paul's old slippers. Um, she likes to play with her, so you see. I don't need to have your bloody butt in my face. Turn around. <laughs> I don't want to see your butt. <laughs> Sally, turn around. I don't want to see your butthole. No, thank you. That C. Have you got daddy's old slipper? Have you got daddy's old slipper? Is that fun? Daddy's old slipper? Yes, you can play with that. <laughs> ah. Seriously? She can actually hold the slipper. I'll try to see if she do it. You're full of it. <laughs> Get off me. <laughs> full of it, you silly puppy, 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 puppy. I just finished my ice cream and I am just about to go have a shower. 
And it won't be long before I have to tra- trim my beard a bit. It's getting long. Very long, actually. I'm tired. Yeah. Alright, um, so I'm going to see you guys tomorrow. And take good care. Peace. And don't forget to be awesome and epic. As you always are.